And this is the lineup in the first of them. Cuba with Sevon Pineda. Twenty-seven years of age. Competed in the long jump here, incidentally, but he is the world champion in the 100 and the 200 in this classification. Also, Parapan American champion. Hard to beat. And with the mountain to climb against the world champion is Tobias Jonsson, the 20-year-old from Sweden. Sixth in the long jump. Didn't compete in the 100 metres in London and Azerbaijan with Elmir Chabrailov. Chabrailov is 24. Has a personal best of 11.39, both Johnson and Jabrailov with similar lifetime bests. But this should be a walk in the park for Savon Pineda. So the field of three in the first heat underway and Savon Pineda on the inside began very well and look at him go so smooth he'll take the heat comprehensively as we thought he would the time will be interesting 1089 and that is a really good pipe opener it's not that far outside the Paralympic record in the overall scheme of things Dobreyalov has finished in second position and Jonsson in third 1127 and 1157 respectively personal best seasons best respectively but uh, too good there the Cuban and that was comprehensive Paralympic record is 1075 that was set in Athens 12 years ago by uh, Adit Soji of Nigeria that time 1075 and G7 Pineda in the final is going to give that a push did well really Simon Pineda unchallenged for Cuba shot away good vi margin of victory only the winner guaranteed to progress in this T12 category None of them going with guides, you'll notice. It is optional. Well, over the 100 metres, confident enough that they had the necessary top speed to go in the straight line. Seven Pineda, 1089, a very solid, simple qualifier through to the final. This could be wide open. It's 11.27 for Zabrailov, who was just about 0.3 of a second in the end. Selena Savan-Pineda with the victory, 10.8.